eternity. And he lived out from that. That was his joy. That was his rock. That was his stability. That was who he was. It just was who he was. And he enjoyed that. And that's what made him unshakable. That's what made him unstoppable. No man gave him his identity. And so, you know, when somebody treated him wrong, he didn't say, man, man, that hurt my feelings. Can you imagine Jesus didn't get his feelings hurt? He had feelings, but he didn't get his feelings hurt. He never gave his feelings to a man. His father had his feelings. His father had his feelings. And so every place that you've got your feelings hurt, just let that go. Because you're holding on to the hurt because you gave your identity to them. You take it back and you say, no, no, no. No, you, that hurt me when you said this about me because that's not who I am. Well, why are you so hurt about it? You're believing what they say, apparently. <laughs> Take it back. Say, no, no, no. I don't give that to you anymore. My Father shows me who I really am. My Father shows me my value. And guess what your value is? It's the blood of His Son. He gave Himself up for you. Amen. He said, I surrender the blood And I put him in a human body so that he could live and so that he could die for you because as a divine being, he could not die. But as a man, he could live for you the life that he wanted you to have. He could die in your place to say you're of this much value to me even no matter what you've done. So the sooner that you can see with your own eyes the love of the Father in His heart for you, the more that you can grasp and allow your heart to really open up to receive how much you are loved by Almighty God, you're going to be transformed. But Almighty God says, you know what? I will not leave you as orphans. God showed up on the scene and there was all these orphans running around everywhere. They were hurting each other and they were getting hurt and He looked at them. They were physically beaten down. They were mentally beaten down. They were emotionally beaten down. And he, said, he said over and over, He said, don't give it a thought. God knows what you need. He will take care of you. Your hairs on your head are numbered. Yeah, I mean, he talks about this stuff. And he's not, he's not a hypocrite. This is how Jesus lived. He was just speaking to you his own mindset. This is what it's like to be a son. It's fun being a son. You know.